Welcome to Farm Focus. In this video, we will demonstrate the current functionality Farm Focus has to help you with your invoicing needs and to assist with keeping track of your debtors. When you first log in to Farm Focus, you will be shown the dashboard. Here you can have a quick view of your invoices coming up that are owed or owing or anything that is overdue or current. The quick link button here will take you directly to your actual screen to view your invoices if they need attention. In your settings in Farm Focus, you will need to ensure that you have your bank account details set up so that your invoices are sent out with the correct bank details on them for your customers to direct credit. Have a look at your contact list and check that your customers' postal addresses are up to date. Our address finder will help you. Just start entering in the address and the rest will populate for itself. This will meet the correct format for IRD tax invoice requirements. It can be handy to duplicate your web browser tab so that you can have multiple areas of Farm Focus open at the same time. For instance, if you want to flick between your tax invoices and your contact list, you can do this by using the right mouse click on your browser tab and selecting the duplicate option. The Needs Action area of Farm Focus is where you will be entering the detail of your invoices. To create a tax invoice, select this icon. Input your invoice date, your due date and other party. You can choose to have a future dated invoice if you need. It is mandatory to enter a description, a quantity and a unit price. The code you apply will allow for quick matching later on when your bank transaction comes in. You can also apply a tag if you need for your own reporting purposes. Depending on the amounts you have quoted for your services, you can choose to input as GST exclusive or inclusive by selecting this option. If you don't yet have all of the information you need for the invoice, but you want to start the process, you can create a draft. Just put in the information you have so far and click to save draft. This will create a draft in your needs action screen which will be flagged with an orange token. Once you have all of the information you can reopen the invoice, make the changes needed and click to preview and generate. Scroll through to make sure the details are correct. Your payment options will be driven from the bank account number in your settings and are displayed at the bottom of the invoice. You can click Cancel if you need to make further changes or click Generate Tax Invoice to save as a PDF. This PDF will be in your Downloads folder on your computer and you can send this via email to your other party. Once the file is generated, the tax invoice will have a unique invoice number issued for easy identification. It will also be flagged with this number in the Needs Action screen. If you want to delete the invoice, you can choose this option from the three menu dots. The invoice number will also show in your tax invoices screen, where you can see a list of invoices created. Slide the toggle across to see any that you may have deleted. You can choose to restore it if needed by selecting from the three menu dots. If you send out invoices to the same customer on a regular basis, and the items are generally the same each time, you can click into a past invoice and choose from the more options to copy the invoice. This option will allow you to make a copy. You can edit whichever details you want and then generate a new invoice for that person. This saves you from having to start an entire new invoice from scratch. If you have regular invoices which are for the same person and the same amount every time, you can set up a repeating invoice. When you are creating the invoice, select the More Options button. Click here to Repeat Invoice. It will give you the option to select a repeating frequency such as weekly, monthly or annually. And you can choose for this to repeat until further notice or until a certain date. Click Apply to save these changes. 
Once you have saved this repeating invoice, the first one will populate in your needs action screen. The invoice will populate here at the start of each frequency cycle. If you wish to view a list of your repeating invoices or you want to delete them, you can do this at any time in the repeating tab. There may be times that you have sent out an invoice to a customer and it remains unpaid or perhaps they have lost it. If you want to generate a copy of your invoice and send it out again, you can do this by going to the invoice and selecting Generate Copy. This will download a copy for you to send out again. Farm Focus has options to personalise your invoice. In the Tax Invoices tab, click on the Settings icon. You can upload your logo or drag and drop the picture into the box here. Use the rubbish bin icon to delete if you want. You can also add a personalised message at the bottom. Tracking your debtors is easy in Farm Focus. In the report section, you will see the tax invoice summary report. This tracks all of your outstanding tax invoices. You can view by other party and see which invoices are current, 30, 60 or 90 days outstanding. The amounts are totaled at the bottom for each of the groups. You can print this page or download a PDF for your records. In the Tax Invoice tab of your Actuals, you can also quickly navigate to your Age Debtors from there. When transactions are paid through to your bank account, you will match them to the Tax Invoice, either from within the transaction or the invoice, by clicking the Match option. You can also use the Quick Matching option. If the customer has paid one bank payment which covers multiple invoices, you can click all the invoices to match to one transaction. This also applies in reverse. You can match several bank payments to one invoice. If you need to search for old invoices, you can use the search icon on the tax invoice screen or filter by any of the category headings. Also have a look in other financial years. The tax invoice function is part of the core offering in Farm Focus and is available to every user. If you have any questions, please don't hesitate to contact our friendly support team on 0800 888 080 or email support at farmfocus.co.nz.